Okay, it's great. We've got uh, Maxine Gabel from France, winner from yesterday under 66 kilogram category. We're going to just have a little bit of a chat about yesterday and a little bit about your background as well. So how do you feel after your win? Yes. And uh, it's a good day, and, uh, and I win. And so yeah. Before you, before th uh, the morning, your preparation. Uh, how are you feeling about your, your contests? I sleep uh, not good, mm -hmm. but um, it's like that. Uh, the after even the, the, the competition, but uh, no. I do a good warm up mm -hmm. and uh, but uh, the first one was a little so so in the front of the competition i go go up and uh, expand my level yeah and uh, yeah. tell us a little bit about your judo style because uh, throughout today you look very comfortable like nobody could touch you and uh, when you go into a contest, what is your feeling about how, how do you want to win the contest? I don't have um, uh, a method to win a contest. I really approach him in a strong feeling and uh, I really uh, have uh, one thing with the, the Kumikata yes. and uh, do uh, my better in Kumikata and... Uh, take uh, any uh, opportunities uh, to finish uh, what matter it's yeah. uh, Ipon, uh, Newaza, Shido I will take it uh, and uh, yeah yeah I was uh, I th we thought uh, when we were watching you you were in control all the time and that was the most important part of your judo was your kumikata and uh, where you move first and, and making your opponent attack yeah. and put them in a lot of difficulty so throughout today it did it got better and better throughout today yes. so it was really good to watch also okay. your um, your plan for your next competition will you fight in the junior world championships yeah um, i don't have a plan um, i um, will to prepare me uh, like uh, i'm prepared to the open championship mm -hmm. i know this is a uh, another competition and another level with another great fighter from uh, ASEAN and mm -hmm. other. So I want to just uh, have fun and uh, want to win uh, yeah. like uh, yesterday. Let's talk about your background in yes. judo. So how did you get into doing judo originally? Uh, originally I'm from Guadeloupe. I was born uh, here. And uh, it's my parents to put me in judo because I'm a uh, really uh, exciting uh, mm -hmm. child. And uh, I really love it. Yeah. So. And also, you have another French, uh, very famous athlete who was uh, from Guadeloupe yes. as well. Yes. yes. Uh, Kenny Livez uh, yes. is from Guadeloupe yes. too. And uh, we know each other like uh, uh, since time. Uh, yeah, that's great. Yeah. And, yeah. and where do you train? I'm training in Paris now uh, mm -hmm. in INSEP and uh, with the other French team. Uh, yes. Like and, and do you have any inspiration uh, from other, uh, maybe French fighters or uh, world competitors as well? Uh, I don't have one inspiration, one judo inspiration. Mm -hmm. I really uh, like to take in different uh, people, like uh, in France, uh, the Newata mm -hmm. of Axel Clergy, yes. you know, the cardio and the... The motivation yes. of uh, Kylian de Bush in 66. Yes, of course. And uh, the Kumikata of uh, Tiji Winner. Yeah. Uh, so really you can take a, a the best of the best yes. and put it together and have yeah. your own style. Yes. Yeah. What was interesting yesterday was both yourself and your teammate uh, all both won the final with the same technique. Yes. And uh, is that something that is uh, planned and you work on the same technique or was it just a coincidence? No, it's just a coincidence. But... Yeah. Uh, we already um, fight uh, with him and uh, practice with him, so we can and we really uh, good in Newaza. So we just uh, take the opportunity uh, mm -hmm. who present to to us 
and uh, we win the same manner, but uh, it's a uh, coincidence. And yeah. I really uh, good. For, uh, appreciate for, yeah. for him. I think it's a really exciting time for French judo. We have a lot of changes in France, but what I've recognized is that your junior men's team has become really, really strong for the future. Maybe maybe a little bit short for Paris, but maybe for LA Olympic Games. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, I, I, we have a good team. We have a good boy team, a good girl team. Mm -hmm. And uh, we um, have a, a, a real team with a real uh, strong uh, uh, link. And uh, we should to, we need to to make uh, another competition, another great competition in senior, yeah. and, uh, and uh, maybe the the Paris 2024 and mm -hmm. uh, Los Angeles. Uh, yes. Yeah. So and uh, so, following on from that, my question is, who's gonna make it on the podium? Who can win now from France in your team here? Um, <laughs> yeah. Who's your favorite? Give us a prediction. I. <laughs> Really uh, sad, but for my friend to just uh, lose your uh, his fight mm -hmm. and Joan is uh, already a good judoka. And uh, but I know the f uh, 81 category we have two judoka, mm -hmm. and I know uh, if if us is a good day, we he, we can win and be in final uh, right. uh, yeah yeah so um, maybe uh, the other category like uh, 19 90 and uh, mm, minus uh, hundreds hundred yes plus we have a, a, a really good team. strong yeah i'm wish uh, us a good competition and i i would yeah her to uh, put a uh, put a good feeling uh, yeah for win Okay, well, good luck. We hope uh, to see you soon. Good luck for the World Championships thank coming you. up. And thank you very much for talking thank to you. us. Thank you very much.